up juice crew <laughs> don't mind the hair uh it is about to go down um so these pieces are getting cut i'm about to transition into my mullet idea so um this is pretty much like going to be the longest part of my hair i'm getting this top Cut down at least this much is gonna be gone. Cause I gotta remember, you know, doing like this, I need it to still kind of blend in with this hair, but not so much, but you know, still have a difference. You know what I'm trying to say? You know what I'm trying to say. So, yeah. So, hopefully, that. And I may be dying my right hair. Possibly. Like I said, I've been saying that y'all have never heard me say because I never put it on camera. Um, but I have gray hairs now. I got like a strand here and there and you know, a little bunch of bitty a uh, gray hair and I want to keep my gray hair y'all know how long it's been since I've been saying I wanted gray hair so I don't want to let my gray hair go but this hair I can't there's it's nothing nothing else I can do with this hair like um the color isn't given like it used to so I don't know um, I did buy me some clippers. Um, from Sally's. Um, these Andy's. These Andy clippers. Um, there that um envy combo i don't know what i was thinking y'all um the envy combo adjustable blade clipper corded tr trimmer okay so adjustable blade clipper and corded trimmer whatever and it comes with all those little gizmo things at the bottom y'all know um, uh, yeah, so not that I'm going to do it myself, my co-worker is going to do it for me. Hopefully he don't mind me recording it, um, but I have to wash my hair because it was in those braids for a while and I got, um, got to be in the other BLT, BTL stuff in my hair. I'm supposed to be off three days, a three day, whatever. I had to work tonight because my coworker called in sick. So, um, yeah. So I was supposed to be getting up early. Well, I'm still up early to get my toes done. Oh my gosh, guess what y'all? Let me say this right quick. I cut some of my hair out when I was cutting those crochet braids out. <sighs> I ain't doing them crochets no more. So anyways, but yeah, I'm gonna see what time a nail shop open and just walk in cause I need to get my toes done something seriously. Like, for real, so I'm serious. Um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> so I need to do this try on haul, y'all. I bought another bathing suit. Ooh, yeah. So I bought another bathing suit from Walmart. Similar to that green one, but it has. I mean, it has um, straps, but it's still 
your back rolls are gonna be out, honey. The back rolls gonna be out, honey. I don't know, y'all. I always be saying shit. <laughs> oh shit. Um, three X. Twenty six bucks. They had bathing suits up there for forty two dollars. Looks like what? Excuse me. And it just has this thing that holds it together in between. Um, I think the boobies gonna fit up in the. <laughs> All right, I can adjust them straps. I wish I could take them apart and do like a cross thing. Yeah. Alright y'all. I'm going to sit here and chill and try to find me a... Um, this is so cute. Find me a um, nail shop. Girl, them back, that backpack going to be out, booty. I mean boo-boo. I ain't talking about shit. Let me finish watching TV. I got this downy ball. And that's it. how different a haircut makes how different a haircut makes Ooh, hold on got my towel going the wrong way hey oh what is up just how are y'all doing? <laughs> um, I am doing well. It is like, what time is it? 10.30. Um, Thursday, March 23rd. Oh, I'm off today too? Yes, I'm off. I was supposed to be on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. No, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. But I had to work Tuesday. So, yeah. I'm going to go back until Friday night. Oh, and John Wick comes out tomorrow. I might go see that. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. Uh, if y'all haven't seen, I cut my hair. Well, I didn't cut my hair. My coworker, he cut my hair for me. And yeah, I just look so different when I, I sh I'm gonna show y'all how I look. Well, be whatever, I'm gonna show a clip in it because I tried to, um, I couldn't really record because what we were at, um, where we were at, I is I we was in the workplace pretty much, um, and I couldn't show you, you know our background and anything like that because you might see where I work at and uh, you know um so what I was about to say so yeah uh but I did show a little bit oh that was a burned I seen um now I showed a little bit after and I was sh showing y'all when you know cutting these sides off it made my face look smaller like I don't know like you can see more of my face and not my hair because now it's pushed back 
Um, so yeah, it just made me look, I was like, oh my gosh. Uh, but then he also shaved all of my um, sideburns, which is, feels so weird to me because I'm used to um, picking my hairs right here. Um, it's like a nervous type of thing or when I'm thinking about something a lot, I always pull the hairs that are right here and I don't have any hairs to pull and it just feels so weird, but yeah, so yeah, this is what I do. Just pulling my little hairs, but they're not there. <laughs> but anyways, I'm excited. I'm glad I got my hair cut. I've been wanting my hair cut for a good minute and I asked two other people if they can do it they act like they were too scared to and I'm thinking it's my hair I'm asking you to do it like they were saying stuff like they didn't want to cut my hair because what if they messed up or whatever and I'm like it's okay it's just hair it'll grow back you know y'all I'm so mm. Changing how I think. Um, not too much, you know, because this is the type of person I am, anyways, in general. So I'm not gonna change myself so much, but I'm gonna change how I do stuff. And when I okay, this is what I mean. Um, I think about people. Like my like people that are close to me, like friends, family, boyfriends, you know, people I'm talking to and stuff like that. I think about us, you know, like what we can do, what we can't do, friend wise too, like you know, family and stuff like that. I think about us as a whole. Everybody else thinks of their selves. You know, they're going to do what's best for themselves. I'm going to do what's best for, you know, they're going to do what's best for themselves, which is cool because that's what you're supposed to do. You are supposed to do things that are what's best for yourself. But I always think what's best for us, you know. So recently, a lot of people have just been letting me down because, you know, they think of themselves. <laughs> they putting their selves first and it's cool. But now it's like, okay, well now I have to start putting myself first. Like I have to think about myself and what what's going to be best for me. I mean, I have done it before, um, you know, because I'm way up in Florida. I had to, you know, do things that was best for me and moving out to Florida away from other people was best for me. Um, it's just recently I've been um, allowing myself to get everybody else you know instead of myself because when you know things go on they think about themselves they're gonna put themselves first they're gonna do whatever they feel is best for themselves so um yeah i've been disappointed these last couple of months um uh, years i've been talking to y'all know my friend i've been telling y'all about and how he buys me all these things and stuff like that and i am not um a gift type of person okay let me not say it like that because i do enjoy gifts i do enjoy people <laughs> you know buying me stuff thinking about me and things like that but my love language is quality time Period. I love to spend time with people um, being under, you know, if whenever I get my own man. <laughs> you know, I like to be up under them, going places, doing stuff. I like to be, that's quality time for me. Hanging out, watching TV, playing dominoes, just shit, sitting and chilling, um, smoking, you know, just cooling it. That's, that's, that's me. I love that. I don't need to go out. I don't need to get a tons of gifts, tons of gifts. I don't need, you know, you have to send me flowers every day. You don't have to do none of that stuff like that. Like, I'm just, that's just not me, right? So, my friend, he does that. He thinks 
well that's what they like because he's the aries and i know aries giving gifts or receiving gifts is their love language <clears throat> some aries i'm not saying all but so so um he likes to give things and it's cool but if yours is giving and mine is loving it's like it's But I kind of already figured like the relationship that we have wasn't going to be any more than what it is. Um, but you know, when you talking to somebody almost three years, you're getting to like them, getting to, you know, know them and, um, you know, starting to fall for them. But as much as we have in common as much as we laugh and talk and you know he sends me stuff and all these things and all of that is all good and just it sucks that nothing else is going to happen and i'm putting other people that i could meet like up to his standards you know what i'm trying to say like well if they don't have stuff as similar to this person then I'm not even going to bother, which is, is good and is bad. Um, <sighs> yeah, it's good and it's bad, but I need to move on for this, from this situation. Um, I tried to do it before. Uh, when I knew when nothing going to happen because when we got into this uh, particular situation I already knew he had another situation going on and you know how we met was you know <laughs> uh, so it, it wasn't like it was supposed to become anything else you know but like I say talking to a person for I mean some years and really getting to know somebody you know you want to be around that person more than you know you want to be around per a person that makes you comfortable and I'll find somebody that will do the same thing you know I get that same feeling being comfortable um, also being able to receive gifts as well you know like all that same stuff but with somebody else who actually wants to do other stuff that I can't do other stuff with. Like, go on vacations and stuff like that. Because my birthday was pretty boring. Um, when I went to St. Augustine, it was cold. So I really couldn't do much of anything out there. Because I'm not going to be in no cold weather. I love me too. So, you know, I celebrated as best as I wanted to. Um... The only difference, if, if I was with somebody else, I probably would have been drinking more. <laughs> yeah, I probably would have drunk more. I probably would have been out at night more than, um, yeah. That's, that's, I think that's the only difference. I would have been drinking more because I would have somebody, you know, who watched my back. And we would have been out later. You know, I would have been out at night because I'm a night person and I like the nighttime better than the daytime. But whatever. So, but anyways, y'all, um, that's a whole lot of talking. I haven't talked to y'all in a minute. That's why I'm talking so much. I haven't talked to y'all since my birthday. And today's the 23rd. I talked to y'all yesterday. And that was about it. So the 22nd, 23rd is when I started talking back to y'all from the 15th. It was just a lot from the from my birthday time to now, you know, my time of the month, it came. I wasn't trying to deal with nobody. And then all this other stuff, letting go of things and people was also going on. So it was like, mm, yeah, but... I got my hair cut. 
Uh, I'm about to go to um, get my toes done. I need to go to, I may go to the beauty supply store or like Walmart or something and get me some hair color. So I can dye my hair. Y'all, I have a gray hair back here somewhere. Y'all can't see it and I didn't even know it was there until I cut my hair and I was like, oh, I got a gray hair right there. Way back in the back in the back. Mm -hmm. Um, But yeah. And if I don't know if I want to cut my hair now that I say I got a gray hair. Mm -hmm. Anyways. Uh, so yeah, that's what's on the agenda today. I still need to go do my taxes. I still need to. <laughs> I ain't done my taxes yet. I have to go in before April, with April 15th, so I think I'll do it sometime in April, or whenever I'm off next, because uh, when you paying taxes, you don't even really care about taxes, because <laughs> all I'm doing is paying shit. Um, yeah, then I got some other stuff I need to do, y'all. But I have to wait to these damn property tax. Listen, Houston, Texas, or Texas, I don't know if it's Texas in general, but the Harris County tax people took so long for this one HISD tax to come through so that I could pay um, some property taxes. It was all the way up until March. I finally paid off. Yeah, long story, long story. But now that that part is over, I can start, you know, doing the other stuff. But anyways, y'all, all right, talking about just updating y'all on what's been going on this last week or so. Yeah, I think that's it. Um, yeah. I have my hair cut. Well, a bald spot. Whatever. <laughs> my mullet is coming, y'all. It's coming. So, listen. We ain't got my toes done already. It's all, all that's done. Uh, came to Verizon. Listen, I'm part of the crew now. I'm part of the crew now. That's all I'm saying. I'm part. <laughs> I'm part of the crew now. I mean, I still have my phone now because I'm talking to y'all on my, on my phone. But I'm I'm part of the crew now. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm part of the crew. I will show y'all when I get. Um, uh, when I get you know back to my room and stuff like that. But I'm also coming from Ulta. Cause I was trying to find me some hair dye, but it looks like I'm just gonna have to go to the beauty supply store. Of course, I should have known that. Um, I mean, Ulta has um, hair dyes and stuff like that, but nothing, nothing, nothing for me. I mean, no, I'm gonna stop lying. They did have a hair, a hair color that I wanted, which was the um, light blonde coppery color but they had it was an open box and i was like no i'm not about to buy an open box of anything so they didn't have another box so i just said no i'll just go to the beauty supply store instead um they should have a couple of boxes of different color you know and especially uh for my hair type um so yeah yeah, my hair feels so dry right now. After I put in that my that my Ellie stuff that I bought, the tropical whatever that shit is, that blue color one, you know. Um, I don't think it's working for my hair. I like the shampoo and I like the conditioner, but everything else doesn't work for my hair. The uh, well no, the leave-in conditioner does. Bitch, you still but, bad. Yeah, I came by the mall. I'm not going in that mug. I wanted to. I'm tempted to go in there and see if I can get my ears pierced again. Or get the third a third hole in my ear. 
um, because I just want it. Maybe I should call them and see. Since I'm right here, no need to leave and come back and all that stuff like that. But then washing my hair, I'm washing it and dyeing it. Come on now. I'm I'm a uh, dying and watch it. Will that mess up my ears? I mean, I know it's not going to mess up my ears or anything like that. I'm just saying, not this one. This one. <sighs> Let me see. I'm going to call them and see um, if they have uh, room for, to get my ears pierced now since I'm out here and uh, stuff. And stuff and stuff. It is hot out here, 84 degrees, honey. I'm glad I got my little side shade. <laughs> Turn my AC on right quick. Um, yeah, y'all. Let me let me call y'all right back. Uh, not call y'all right back. Let me let me see these call these people. Hold on. Okay, so I called them and um. Mm, $70 cuz it's $50 for the pair and then it's $20 if you buy their jewelry. And she said the only jewelry they got is jewelry with big gems on and I'm like, huh? I don't know that. Or I can bring in my own um stainless steel surgical whatever whatever type of earrings things um so yeah i may see if there's uh, another place say if i go somewhere else another town state city uh maybe i'll go and see if they can uh pierce my ears but it ain't no it ain't no need i just wanted to go since i was already out out in this area and um I wanted my ears pierced, so um, yeah, maybe I'll find another tattoo place that's around that does it for the low low and not have to pay additional dollars, additional money for earrings. Cause don't that shit already supposed to come? Like if you had that gun, are you you know you you just clipping that what's name to your ear? I tell them they're talking about an extra twenty dollars if we use their jewelry. What? No, thank you. I just stick with the tattoos, honey. I'll stick with the tattoos. Okay, thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> That's what I said. Ah. So you know, I'm I'm just excited. So far, this this new beginning is exciting. This new start. It just feels so good to shed dead weight and not my pounds weight, but somebody else's dead weight. And it it does. Um, it's sad that I had to end. I literally, it literally ended two relationships. One was really good for me in a sense that um, I was telling y'all we had a lot in common. You know, we talked a lot. But to know that it won't go anywhere than what it is, it's, that's the sad part about it. Um, but to know that behind this part is going to be something better. It's going to be something good from what I hear. Uh, my terror, you know, from what my reading says that it's going to be good. Right, right from this. Right from me getting past and going through all the stuff that I'm going through, um, that it's going to be good for me. So, I'm very excited. I'm very excited for my future. I've always been excited for my future. I just need to put in plans the stuff that I need to put in plans to get things started, get things moving. Like I said, it's been three months and it feels like I'm making money because I have a job, but 
I'm not making the money that, uh, you know, from a, a business that I feel that I should have started already. You know, I feel like I should be um, further along. I know that sounds stupid, um, but to me, I should be further along in things. But again, like I say, life be life and life is life. Plans never go how you think they're going to go. So I'm still in a good space. I'm still in good mentally, phys physically and all that stuff. I'm, I'm good. I'm really good. It's, uh, yeah, I'm just excited, y'all. <laughs> Go to this dang um, beauty supply store. And I am hungry, honey. I'm trying to figure out if I want to actually go to some type of restaurant, but I probably don't. I don't know. Get some drinks or something. I was thinking that, but I, I don't. I'm lying to myself because I don't want that. I don't want that at all. I'm going to just find me something to eat and bring my tail back to my room. Talk to my coworker because so she should be here. She should be here now. Let her see my hair because she's going to be like, oh my God. Oh my God, who did that to your hair? Yeah. So. <laughs> I just want to see, I want to see her face when she sees my hair. It's going to be hilarious. I, I think it's going to take a minute because you can't see it from the front. It just looks like my hair is pulled up. But you got to get close on it to see that it's not there anymore. So, yeah. I just want to, yeah. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let me go. Okay, y'all. So, I'm back. In the room and all that good stuff. Um... This is the hair color. Y'all may see the hair color before y'all see this video. So, yeah. So once I do this, I need to get my what's the name out. So yeah, y'all will see this hair color before. Um, I think it's called Vivacious Red. No, yeah, Vivacious. Vivacious. Y'all, I'm trying to show y'all too much shit. Vivacious. Red. It's dark and lovely. I bought it because it's cheap. And, oh. My hair is kind of, but it's like an ashy black. So, it may turn out to be this middle color. I don't know why I didn't look at the back. Do I want my hair that color? Is that too red? Cause I kinda want a brown red. I didn't even notice the back y'all, that's crazy. So, I want it kinda like this color, but a little browner. I was looking at this top part. Cause the top part looks like, um, you know, it doesn't look. It looks light. I mean, I want it light. <sighs> we gonna see. I might go back and switch off the colors. Anyway. Um, yeah, so I went to Verizon. Oh, also I went to Ulta. Like I told y'all, I was looking for some um, some hair dye. And they didn't have any. Well, they had one. Y'all know I told y'all. But uh, as I was looking out, I seen that they had some. Oh, these are eyeliners. 
um, some Juvia's Place uh, colored liners. Okay. They were on clearance for $3.75. And I got those colors, a purple, a white, and an orange. I didn't know they were eye, eye colors. I just bought them. Oh, they liquid eyeliner. I just bought them because it was three, $3.75 and they was uh, Juvia's Place. I have one thing that's Juvia's Place. I bought some an eyeshadow palette, an eyeshadow palette. Okay, I can put some white. I don't know why I bought this, y'all. Crazy impulse bought, buying type shit. Oh, that's what I was gonna tell my coworker. Anyways. Verizon. When I say I'm part of the crew now, I'm part of the crew. I have an iPhone. I got an iPhone 13. Cause it was free. <laughs> All I'm paying is like the, uh, the bill. You know, the phone thing. Uh, so, yeah. It's free. And I'm only paying, I think, an extra $50 for this phone. So, yeah. I almost opened it because my coworker was talking about hers and how she cracked hers. So I popped this seal part already. It was a little seal there. Just letting y'all know it's an iPhone 13. Yep. Pop that seal. Oh my gosh. I have, this is my very first ever iPhone. I got the green one just cause to be different. This motherfucker is heavy. Dang, this phone is heavy as shit. Let me put this bitch back in now. Hold on. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna have to put this on my bed and open it. We gonna go through it. I just want to see it for the first time and pick it up. Compared to my phone, y'all, that phone is heavy. My little phone, light, lightweight. This is not heavy. This, this is a paperweight. How do y'all, how do y'all? Oh my God. How do y'all do this? Yeah, that's all right. I already got a case and it works. Of course it's purple. <laughs> what other color would it be? I already knew I was getting an iPhone 13 because it was for free. <laughs> so yeah that's what i got that's what i done i got to um i'm get up very early in the morning um as early as i can i might set my alarm to seven so that i can be out by eight so that i can start looking at these places um looking at some of these places because I, I i need like i tell y'all i need to start start moving and shaking like i didn't come here to florida just to work you know work work a job i want to work on my shit too so um yeah i'm about to eat some of my winnies and go back down and talk to my co-worker and i will be back to talk to y'all uh, later 
So, yeah. Yeah. John Wick 4. So we are out early in the afternoon. Uh, it's 12, 10, cause John Wick is supposed to start right now. And I'm just now pulling up. I was out looking for um, places, um, office spaces and stuff like that. So while I was out, I was like, I might as well come to the movies. Hi. Jonathan Wick. <laughs> Is there another one of these? Uh, I'm not sure. <laughs> oh. I can do tickets right here. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm not sure if either one's working. Y'all. John Wick was amazing. It was so good. John Wick was so amazing. I'm so sad that that might be the last John Wick movie. Oh my God. I hope not. I hope not. If he comes back. Oh my God. That movie was so good, y'all. That movie to me was so good. You know, I, I love John Wick. I love Keanu. Oh. That movie was so good to me. To me, that movie was so good. I love John Wick. I love, I watched the, when it came on sci-fi, it came on all this week, a weekend or whatever, however. One, two, and three came out. And guess what? I watched them all as if I'd never seen them. And they all are good. All are good. All of them. This last one. <sighs> so good. So freaking good. Y'all, I think I'm going to get one of these Regencies Unlimited like movie pass things. Because I see that I come here a lot. I do go to the movies a lot. And I want to see Dungeons and Dragons. And I want to see Super Mario Brothers. So, and I want to see that Renford, uh, that movie with, uh, um, Nicolas Cage playing, um, Dracula. Yes, I want to see that movie too. So, and I think the pass is only like $21 or something like that. So, $22 all together. So, yeah, I think I'm, I think I'm getting a movie pass, unlimited movie pass. Because today I spent... She said, he said 12 something, but it rung up 13. Who's this damn caterpillar on my, on my window? Um, so, um, yeah. So, I think I'm going to get a movie pass. A movie pass. Um, to the movies. So that I can watch it more frequently i'm so excited so anyways yeah okay so don't look at all this other stuff but this is uh what i had on today this dress and um you can't see my shoes but i have on hold on i'll show y'all listen don't be talking about my shit it's a limited space. Hold on. So, these are the shoes I had on. I got my toes done, of course. And purple. 
So, yep, I had these on. Oh, and if you see by my, the colors that's in my dress, it matches my toes perfectly. Um, so yeah, I had that on today as well as this super goop glow oil SPF 50 because it is hot here in Florida. It's 80, 84. Is it 84? Mm -hmm. Let's see, update. 84 degrees, I'm correct. At 4.10 in the afternoon, I'm just coming from seeing John Wick. Four. Can y'all believe that somebody from this address has tried to buy something from my PayPal account? Here. I've already canceled that card out so you ain't gotta worry about it. Yeah, someone's trying to buy something off my PayPal from this number, from this address. Y'all, I went on, I was checking my account because I was about to move some, some stuff around just like I do any other night. And I look at my, I look at my account and I see some money's taken out. Ooh, ooh what did I get y'all up close? Okay, just be sorry about that. I had to put my camera up because I was using my phone to look up the information and stuff. Yeah, can you believe somebody tried to use my PayPal? I canceled it. I took the card off. I'm canceling that whole uh, PayPal thing. And they actually had the nerve to use... Whoever it was actually had the nerve to use my name. They used Miss Fat Juicy and used their address. This I I even I googled the address. This is what I see. Whoever apartment is apartment five A. I don't know where that's at, but it's there. Yeah, I didn't googled. I googled. Hey, you want to do that? Let's see who you are. Let's call you out. Whoever you is, thank you for being an a hole and trying to take from me so whoever's at 2090 uh mohawk mohagen Moha, mohagen avenue uh, apartment 5a in the bronx new york you're not getting your uh boxing gear i'm sorry that's not happening 111 dollars and 48 cents you're not getting it 240 in the afternoon I am about to dye my hair finally. Um, life, <laughs> work, I've been tired, whatever. So I'm finally doing it now. Um, but then also because I wanted to get a different hair color and I'm also mad at myself that I went to another beauty supply store instead of going back and returning this one from the beauty supply store, I bought this one and they had this one at the same beauty supply store where I got this one from. So, I got this color. It's called Pony.
Oh yeah, my hair's gonna be red. <laughs> oh, I was trying to push up my glasses. I don't have them on. Sorry I got y'all so close, but this is the only way I can see myself and see y'all at the same time. You know what I'm trying to say? Uh, but it's on. I think I'm supposed to leave it in there for 30 minutes. I said 20 since it took me a minute to try to um, open up the other bottle and all that stuff like that. Um, but yeah so it's, it was 316 when i looked at the clock so i'm gonna take it out or look at it around 326 330 326 by the same i think that's a, a good amount of time because i didn't look at the clock as soon as i was done so i think that's that's about some odd minutes but anyways like i say i'm gonna look at it see how it looks if i need to let it sit that longer i will but um I think it's taking pretty good already. <laughs> so yeah. And it's dripping down my um uh, dripping down. Okay, y'all are the first people to see. I can't really see anything. Can y'all? I mean I can see something, but not really. We're gonna go outside and look and see how it looks in the sunlight. <laughs> but so far, I don't know. I don't see. I mean, I see it, but I don't know if that was gonna be brighter. I want it brighter, I guess. I should have went with the coppery, orangey. No, I didn't. I don't. I'm about to put this Kalia Wajid apple, green apple and aloe in my hair. Just so it can have something, you know, and make sure. And then I just comb through it, or just, I don't know, leave the curls, but I wanted to, um, I don't know, y'all. Let me, let me go look at my hair right quick. <laughs>